Welcome to the Telebloke channel. Today it's time to talk about secrecy, privacy and security. And secret chats in Telegram are just about that. These chats are designed for people who value privacy more than anything else. All traffic is encrypted from device to device. It means that only you and the other person can read the texts. No one can intercept or decrypt them, including Telegram staff. That's one of the greatest strengths and features of Telegram. By the way, you can also find out about the other features in my previous episodes. There is a lot of fascinating stuff there. And now let's take a closer look at all the charms of secret chats. Let's first figure out how to create a chat. To do this, go to the chat of a person you want to create a chat with, then click on the user's name, go to the profile and tap more which is three dots in the top right corner, and select Start Secret Chat. Now all you have to do is wait for the other person to go online and accept your invitation to a secret chat. If it did happen, remember that secret chats are linked to one device. If you create a secret chat on one of your devices, it will only be available on it. If you sign out, all the secret chats will be lost. You can create as many chat rooms as you want with one person. Texting history is stored only on the devices of the people in the chat and stays out of the service cloud. The secret chat is displayed slightly differently in the list. The user's name is highlighted green and there is a lock next to it. So basically, this is what I wanted to share with you. Your texts are stored only on smartphones or tablets of two participants of the dialogue. But of course, such chats have a lot more interesting features that I'm gonna discuss with you next. Secret chats have a self-destruct timer available. To set it, click on the clock icon. In iOS, it's in the text box and in Android, it's on the upper bar. The timer starts when the recipient reads the message. Two green checkboxes. The time range for self-destructing messages is large, from one second to one week. Once the given time has passed, the messages will disappear without a trace from both devices. You can do the same with pictures too. Once you open it, the timer starts to destroy it. By the way, in a regular chat, you can also send self-destructing pictures. It works pretty much the same way. Select a photo. At the bottom of the screen, click the clock icon and set the timer. It's a small but pleasant thing, right? Note that the timer applies only to messages sent after setting it. It will not affect previously sent messages. In Telegram, you can create an unlimited number of conversations in the form of a secret chat. But please note that if a person is using a desktop version of Telegram or a web version, it's not possible to invite them in such a secret chat. I mean, it's weird why the developers haven't done this for the desktop version, but it's probably for security reasons. Share your thoughts in the comments, please. In a secret chat, you can clear or delete chat history when you no longer need it. The dialogues will be deleted permanently, and it won't be possible to restore them. The important thing is, if you sign out, the secret chat in Telegram will be automatically deleted, but the other person will have all the information. So for more security, it's best to clear the chat history before you sign out. In Telegram secret chats, unlike the usual chats, you can't forward messages. No participant in such a secret chat can send your texts to someone else. I mean, it's super convenient because it's safe to assume that no one is gonna see your texts. And then you might think screenshots. Yeah, the secret chat has its own thing. In Android, it's not possible to make a screenshot in a secret chat. And in iOS, you will instantly get a notification once someone makes a screenshot. Unfortunately, there is no 100% way to prevent taking screenshots anyway, because the other person could for instance, take a picture with their camera or phone. So I would suggest sharing some sensitive content only with the people you trust. Telegram's main idea is to bring security to the masses, to those who understand nothing about encryption or security. Being secure is not enough for this. You have to be fast, powerful and convenient. And Telegram is that kind of messenger. It's important to understand that all Telegram messages are always securely encrypted. The only difference between a secret and a regular chat is only in the encryption method. Client-to-client -client for a secret chat and client-server-server-client 
for a usual one. In work, it's very convenient when you have access to all the chats and files from different devices. That's what they are for. But if there's something you need to share with your friend, then it's better to start a secret chat. Share in the comments your experience using secret chats in Telegram. How often do you use them and what impresses you the most? Share your thoughts with me. Did this video prove useful? Give us a thumbs up and share it, please. And that's it for today. Thanks for watching. It's the Telebloke channel. Subscribe and be trendy.